It is not a surprise to me that the Detroit Lions has signed Matt Asiata. This is Detroit Sports World. My name is Maurice Lewis. The Detroit Lions just signed a bulldozer. This guy has great ball security, and he's a veteran, proven veteran. Um, he's only had a couple good years, though, with the Vikings when he finally got an opportunity. But we know he, what he can do, and it adds well-needed depth to our running back situation. Now, with this signing, though, what does it say about a guy like Teon Green, who's been trying to prove himself, and out of Cincinnati, by the way, He's been trying to prove himself, and he looks like a really good running back. But now his opportunity has shortened. And you know how running backs are when it comes to running backs in the league. Running backs only last about four to five years average. Not even that. So I really hope that, let's just say he do makes the team, but likely he isn't. Um, and if we do cut him, I hope that he makes a practice squad. But if you look at the running back situation now, I mean, we have Theo Riddick, Dwayne Washington, Zach Zinner, Amir Abdullah, um, and now Matt Asiata. So we're deep at running back. Uh, we're deep. Um, but let's just say this, you know, that's, it, it, there's no guarantee that the signing of Matt Asiata, there's no guarantee that. He makes the team. He ha he still has to go through every what everybody else has to go through in making the roster. So there's still no guarantee. His money's not guaranteed, at least. But I like the signing guys because we're getting a guy who, man, fights through tough tackles, fights through pretty much anything, fights to get the extra yard in making the team better, advancing the team. And you're going to get a guy... When it comes to those red zone situations and you need a guy to fight, you are you got that guy in Matt Asiata that can get the one-yard, two-yard, three-yard games, gains um, for the uh, touchdown. So you're getting a good running back. You're getting a proven running back when it comes to that. And that's something that we needed because our red zone situation sucked. Flat out was garbage. And you know that. You know, Matt... Matthew Stafford to bring it all the way down the field. And the next thing you know, in third down situations, we could not convert to get a touchdown. And then we had to rely on Matt Prater to kick a field goal. So I, I like the signing. Um, we I feel like we needed an, another running back, an, another a true running back that could, uh, let's just say we have problems out of our other running backs. Matt Asiata can come in and for sure give, give us what we know he can do. So, love the signing, guys. Let me know what you think. This is Detroit Sports World. My name is Maurice Lewis. You can follow me on all social medias, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, you name it. Hit me up.